you're punching the canvas, but not too hard. You put the paint on and you kind of go like this and dab, 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 dab. And if you dab, 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 it gives it kind of like bunches of paint and it looks a little bit more like it is a 3D painting, gives it more depth. So you can kind of just punch, 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 punch. Lightly, lightly, don't go through the canvas because that would be bad. Give him a little bit more character with his fur. And I think I want some more white in my black areas. So I'm gonna just dip a little bit of white in my black areas, kind of give him a mixture of paint, a mixture of fur. Looks a little, combines a little bit more. This is where you get to make your dog your own dog. Make him look exactly how you want him to look. So then you can go to the shelter and say, hey, mom, dad, I want to adopt a dog that looks like this. Shouldn't be hard to find, might be large though. All right, if you've got his fur looking just how you like his fur to look, just how you like his fur to look, we're gonna be ready for a little bit of dots or hearts, whatever you wanna call it on your kerchief in a minute, on your bandana. And then we're gonna almost be ready to do the face. We have to give the face a little bit of time to dry. Just a tad. I'm gonna give everybody a few more minutes to get that done. We got some great painters here from what I am seeing so far, some awesome painting. Charlie, how is your painting coming? I can see Charlie. Oh, Charlie, that looks great. I love him or her. I don't know whether you want it to be a boy or a girl. Let's see. I see it. I can't tell who it looks like. Daphne, the Martins. They look like they're working very hard there. Yeah, <laughs> it, they look great. They look really good. I'm going to wave from this side. Wave. Let's see who else I can see. I'm trying to see whose paintings I can see so far. Alexa, I can't see your painting. How's that going? Good. All right, so far. And Charlie showed me hers. And Wendy, how are we doing? Are you caught up with us? Do you need help, Wendy? Unmute yourself and tell me if you need help because it looks great so far. Oh my gosh, you're totally caught up. That's amazing. And I can't tell who this is over here. He's holding it up. You've got a chalkboard behind you, but I don't know what your name is. Hi, it looks really, really good. I love it. Except he's gonna be one huge dog if you, he were real. He looks like one amazingly large dog. Oh, I've got the girls up in the corner who have got pictures behind them. It's a white, let's see, she's holding a pink, she's got a pink shirt and there's her sister, I think in green. That's one awesome dog too. These dogs would be really large if they were real. Oh, it's the, is it Pegna family? Pegna? I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Yours is beautiful. I can see it. Let me just check my other page here. Make sure all my friends are ready for the next step. Okay. Your next step, we're going to go back to that red paintbrush. So when you are ready, we're going to go back to that red paintbrush. And we're going to mix a teeny tiny bit of red with some white. So you might want to dump it out onto your, I'm going to hold it up so you can see. I have mine on a paper plate. But what you're going to do is take a teeny tiny bit of white, because remember the dark color goes a long way. 
and I'm gonna drag some white and mix it up. So it gives it sort of a, either a light red or a pinkish color. Now you can make whatever you would like on your bandana. If you want to make a heart, the easy way to do it is just use the very tip of your paintbrush, the very tip, and you just do it on one side and then turn your paintbrush and on the other side to connect it. So it almost looks like a heart. So you're doing one tip, turn your paintbrush to this side and another tip and you've got a heart. If you wanna do just dots, you can do just dots. But if you wanna do hearts, it's just two dots with your paintbrush. One side, other side. Yes, somebody, 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 somebody. Oh, somebody just came in. I don't know whether somebody just came in. Did somebody just come in? Sophia. Sophia, where are you? Yeah, I think he's right, right, but now I don't know where she is. I'm looking for Sophia. Sophia, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Let me see if I can find her over here. I don't see her. Oh, perfect. So my friends that have come in late, we are recording it and we're gonna put it up for you so that if for some reason you missed something or you came in late, you'll be able to catch up. So we're gonna post it later for you. I just know somebody seemed to have come in and now I can't find who it is. So, all right. So that's your red. Those awesome dogs with your awesome bandanas, but his poor little guy needs a face, right? Because otherwise he's gonna have a hard time going down the street. He'll knock into everything if he doesn't. Although he could be a sheep dog and you can't see his face, that could happen. All right, so we're back to black. Remember the rule with black. Black gets used gingerly because black goes a long way. So for this one, and again, you're not gonna see it because my paintbrush is black, but I'm only putting paint on the teeny tiny corner tip. And I just put it all over my finger, but on the teeny tiny corner tip of my paintbrush to put one dot, two dots, If my whole paintbrush was filled, I'd be making a mess. So just one dot, two dots. And then his nose. So now for this one, I'm gonna put the paint again across the whole tip. And I just dot, dot, dot like three times. If you want a bigger nose, make it four times. However big you want your guy's nose to be. My guy I think needs a bigger nose. So I'm just gonna do a couple more dots on him to give him a big giant nose because he's a big giant dog. Maisie, how are we doing? I think you caught up pretty fast, aren't you? Okay, so now we have to give our poor dog a mouth. Again, the paint's just on the tip, very tip of the paintbrush. And I'm gonna put one straight line down. And then I'm going to, I'm not even putting any more paint on. I'm going to put it around and kind of go up a little bit, up a little bit with your paintbrush to give him a smile. You can't see anything. Thank you. Wait, 
no questions today. Wow, that's amazing. Personally, I think it's because you guys have more confidence in yourself than the parents. You guys are like, yeah, this is easy. I can totally paint this. Moms and dads second guess themselves. Oh my goodness, chalkboard boy. I'm loving your dog. I'm gonna call you chalkboard boy from now on because I just don't know your name. So you're chalkboard boy and I love your dog. And I see it's Samantha maybe, I don't know. Sam, I can't tell because I don't have my glasses on, but I like her dog too, it's adorable. But now my dog over here has a little heart around. You can or cannot put it on, it's up to you. The way I have, the way I did it was I took my black paintbrush and I mixed a lot of white in with it. I didn't even put more black on. I just, it was on there. Mixed a lot of white on it because I want to make sure I get nice, a nice gray. And I'm going to just very gingerly make a heart around my dog's eye. I don't want to get to the eyeball because the eyeball might not be dry yet. I want to just go gingerly around it. If for some reason you touch your eyeball, not your real eyeball, your dog's eyeball, it's okay because you can go back in later and we can put another dot on there. Just give him a little heart around his eye. I want to see all these masterpieces when they're all done. Okay, I'm looking here and I'm watching, I think it's Michelle Walsh and I just saw an arm filled with paint. And I thought, well, there you go. They had a good time. They painted their body. Now, what you have to remember to do on your dog is sign your painting anywhere you choose to sign it, but you have to sign your painting because it can't be worth millions of dollars unless you've signed it. 